Shabbat Shalom, friends. This week is known as Shabbat Chazon. The week immediately preceding Tisha B'Av is known as Shabbat Chazon because we read in the Haftarah the very beginning of the book of Isaiah, which begins Chazon Yeshayahu. This is the, the vision of, of Isaiah. And therein we have a very strange line where it says, Come argue with me. Right? And please, let's argue about this. And why, why should that be that God is, is inviting us, asking us, please, to come argue with me? Uh, isn't there enough discord between Am Yisrael and Hashem already? Why do we need more? Says, ah, but this is actually really a very important idea. That when there's discord between two people, uh, or, or especially in people who are close in relationship, one of the ways that we handle that is just by shutting down. I want to ignore you. I don't want to talk to you. We're going to separate. I'm not, you know, I'm not going to engage. And that that's the way when we feel really hurt by somebody that we sort of protect ourselves from continuing to feel hurt. So Hashem is inviting us, no, don't disengage. Come argue with me. Come bring all of your pain, all of your frustration, all of your anguish that you've experienced over the years and come and bring it before me. Let's talk about it. Let's argue about it. And from that, there's a possibility of really returning, of fixing the relationship and of, at, le at the very least, continuing the relationship. And so how important that when we're looking at all the pain and the suffering and the traumas that Am Yisrael has experienced in the last 2,000 years, that we come and we bring it before Hashem and let's argue about it, let's talk about it, let's engage, let's vent all that frustration to Hashem, and at least that way we're engaging, we can continue the relationship. I bless you all and all of us together that we should bring all of our pain before Hashem and on Tisha B'Av be able to come away from it feeling at least cleansed and at least that we've been heard uh, and that uh, our pain is, and our argument has been heard. Shabbat Shalom.